also be L Squad. I'm back with another banger. I said I'm back with another bo -bo banger. Before we get into the video, make sure you smash the like button. Make sure you go to my channel and subscribe. Make sure to turn the post notification bell on because I'm posting two or more videos every single day. You don't miss out on any video I post. That's why I have to have the post notification bell on. Make sure you please subscribe to my channel. Make sure you get notified for every video I post. As soon as we hit 10,000 subscribers. As soon as we hit 10,000 subscribers, we're doing a big, big giveaway. It might be a laptop, might be iPhone, might be, might be something you really, really want. So tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to come subscribe to my channel. I'm also going to be selling t-shirts here soon. As soon as we get the design ready and everything situated. Uh, and I'm also going to be selling t-shirts here soon. As soon as we get the design ready and everything situated. I think I said that. I'm not for sure. But, like I said in my previous video, as soon as we hit 3,000 subscribers, we're doing a big giveaway. Not as big as the 10,000, but we're doing a giveaway. I've been literally slacking on my videos. I know. I've been literally slacking. I don't know why I've been slacking. Actually, I do know why. So, uh, the reason why I, had, I didn't upload last time is because Raiden got sick and everything. So... I couldn't post like every single day like I wanted to because he was sick, but he ended up back in the hospital again. So he's currently in the hospital. He has a virus. He has a rhino virus. He had the same virus last time as he got admitted. So it's just been stressful at this point. But um, when we first went in there, he was getting like, you know, worker breathing, couldn't breathe. He had a stuffy nose. He had a cough. Um, and then they test him for the virus and he has the virus. Um, so it's like if he gets a virus, it's like he's going to be admitted to the hospital because there's like nothing we could do about it. Like he's worker breathing and everything. So he will get he gets admitted to the hospital because uh and he has a heart condition, so that topped that off. So he's gonna be admitted to the hospital every time he gets a virus, and it sucks because I like he was out for a while, like three weeks. He was out of the hospital for three weeks, and then he went back in. The doctors, the nurses said oh, he was out for so long, but not long enough. I know my baby can never get a break from the hospital. Um, but we, when we first went in there, they tried the high flow oxygen because of where his work of breathing and everything. That did not work at all. So the kind of find out they had to stick a breathing tube down his throat because of his how work how hard he was working to breathe. Like he was working to breathe hard. And he, you could tell when he is working the breathing hard because, like, as soon as you take the oxygen off his nose, he's like fussy, fussy, fussy. And I'm like, and like them not like getting to him fast enough is like crazy to me. But um, they just took a breath, the breathing tube out. The yes, not yesterday, the day before yesterday. Um, he's doing fantastic. Um, they're lowering his um oxygen and they're restarting the feeds back up so that's an a plus and they said he's getting better each day um i'm so happy like i'm so happy i really really hope this is not a long hospital stay i tell myself i really really hope this is not a long hospital stay my baby can never catch a break out of this hospital he's always in this hospital 24 7. like he can never catch a break like i just want him better i want him home i want him healthy before he comes home and everything um but when I went up there yesterday, he was doing good. He was, you know, he was fighting his sleep like always. The nurse said he didn't really get a nap. He didn't really sleep through the night. And um, today, he only slept for like two hours today. And I think that's like he's not home. He's used to being home in his own crib. Um <laughs> And, like, I rock him, like, every night before he goes to bed. So, that's another reason, right? He's not getting rocked either because I rock my, him before he goes to bed. Um, and then, like, he just wants to be home. And, plus, he don't feel good, feel that great on top of that. Um, you could tell he's a little bit sick. But I tell myself all the time when he goes in the hospital, I hope this is not a long hospital stay. Because I really want him out to... I really want him out before he sees his heart doctor because I have some questions for his heart doctor. And every time he 
is almost close to seeing her, he ends up back in the hospital. And then we had to wait like a whole month to, to see her again. And I just want to ask her some questions and everything. Because it's always good to ask questions. I'm not going to lie. It's always good to ask questions. And he don't see her when he's admitted to the hospital. So, um, so we have to see her when uh, we go to her office. And that's when he was out it's just so crazy to me it's so freaking crazy to me like i want this and this virus is like going around because there's a lot of kids that got it and a lot of kids that has been admitted to the hospital and everything i feel like another reason why he's getting all these viruses is because he's always cooped up in the hospital and he like never comes outside so he don't know like don't know like our germs outside and he like catches something really fast I feel like the hospital should take him outside, like go on a walk, like take him outside if it's nice outside, take him outside <laughs> if he's feeling up for it. Um, like when he was home, I took him outside as much as possible um, it, when he was well and um, he loves it outside. He freaking loves it outside. Like, let me tell you, he loves it outside. It's so cute. Um, last time, he has a little playpen that we sit outside he has a little playpen so we sit outside and um we put his bumbo bimbo i don't know what it's called bumbo i think inside the um the playpen and he was sitting there he was smiling he was so happy to be outside and then me and him we sat in our front yard into the grass and we sat there um he did go to the park i th i vlogged that he did go to the park while he was out of the hospital he went to the park and it was like for the first time he went to the park ever he loved it he loved to swing he he just enjoyed every bit of it my baby loves it outside he is not gonna be an inside person he's gonna be an outside person for sure i'm an outside person like if i'm cooped up in the house for like way too long way too long I can't do it. I have to literally go outside, go for a walk or something. Like when Raiden was home and he was sick, um, he wasn't that sick though, where his oxygen was like lowering, lowering. Um, but he was sick a little bit. And then I just, when he was sick, when he was he used to um, take naps, I used to walk around and everything. Or like when it was like too cold out for him, I used to walk around, walk around the yard and just, you know, just get some fresh air because everybody needs some fresh air. Nobody will like, everybody needs some fresh air. You can't be cooped up in the house for that long. Like, I hate it. He's going to be an outside person for sure. Um, he was so close to sitting up by himself. We was doing therapy back up. He was so close to sitting up by himself. Um, it's just amazing how close he was sitting up by himself. But <sighs> it sucks that he has to end up back in the hospital. Okay, you guys, like I was saying, it sucks that he's back in the hospital, but I just want him healthy, him home. I want him healthy before he comes home, but yeah, this video is not going to be long. I just want to tell you guys why I haven't been posting, why I haven't been on here, because it's just crazy why I haven't been on here. But I've been slacking on all my videos. I need to, uh, like, not slack on none of my videos no more and everything, so... Once Raiden gets out of the hospital, I'm going to be posting these bangers back to back to back. But I just wanted to let you guys know where I've been at and everything. But this is going to be the end of this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you smash the like button. Make sure you go to my channel and subscribe. Make sure to turn the post notification bell because I post you two or more videos every single day. You don't miss out on any video I post. That's why I have to have the post notification bell on. Make sure to be subscribed to my channel. Make sure you get notified for every video I post. As soon as we hit 10,000 subscribers, we're doing a big, big giveaway. It might be a laptop, might be an iPhone, might be something you really, really want. So tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. Just come subscribe to my channel because I'm lit. I'm also going to be selling t-shirts here soon so they get the design ready and everything situated. But 